I'm Bianca. And this here's Nara. <laughs> We're from a town called Mostro Ferrato. Mostro Ferrato? Hmm. Yet another unfamiliar name. So, does that mean these two are from a. Yes, it would seem so. Much like Elena, Kirill, and the others, these would appear to be visitors from another world. Ah, uh, yes. I, I had wondered about that. This place, it... It doesn't look like anywhere we've ever been in our world. And we've been almost everywhere. Anyway, um, you are... I am Doric, king and ruler of this most marvellous of realms. The monsters of this world, hitherto our faithful friends and allies, have taken leave of their senses and begun attacking humans left and right. We band of brave adventurers would put an end to this woeful state of affairs. So the monsters have forgotten how to behave, have they? Well, maybe we can remind them. Is there something we could show them to make them snap out of it, maybe? Come on. You really think it's going to be that easy? Never mind that. For the moment, we need to make this place safe. And we need to find a foreman and his daughter's fiancé while we're at it. <laughs> In that case, you simply must let us help you. What? I can well imagine what poor Beryl is going through. Being cruelly separated from her fiancé. So it seems we have need of an efficient search and rescue strategy. Very well. First, we must identify the town's key zones. Next, we must clear said zones of enemy combatants. Only when each one is secure you just don't do can we brief, do you? Basically, we need to get rid of all the monsters as quickly as possible. And find the foreman and Beryl's fiance, right? <laughs> <laughs> you two are close as anything, aren't you? Didn't have sweet watching you bicker like that. Huh? <laughs> Seriously, we've just known each other a long time, is it all, right? Right. Childhood friends. It's often the way. Or at least, that's what I'm told. <clears throat> ah. Right, let's get going, shall we? We got us a dad and a fiancé to fight. We do! Remember our strategy! Position! All right. Let's get rid of these monsters and find that foreman. Thank you so much. I don't know how I can ever repay you for doing this. <laughs> Do not mention it, my pretty. All of the day's work for the king of the world. Let us begin our search here. We must drive back the monsters and seek out the missing dwarf. Um, listen, I know you're worried, but don't be. We'll find him, I promise. Thank you. By the way, can I ask why you're both being so kind to me? Don't let me down. Well, the two of us are also expecting to be married soon. I suppose we feel sympathetic towards a fellow bride-to-be. Oh, Nera! Too much information? What? You're both getting married? Then we need to get you back to your world as soon as possible. <laughs> All in good time. First, let's make sure you and those you love are safe. Look lively! We've got company!
system. Inferno Slash! Fine by me. Got herself surrounded again. We'd better do something. Indeed. If we leave her too much longer, she'll. Come on, we need to get those monsters away from her. I've got her hand it to use to. You're an old lot calmer than I'd be if I was you. I nearly had a bleeding heart attack when I showed up in this world all of a sudden. You're joking, ain't you? But we had the fright of our lives. If it didn't seem it, it's probably because... Well, so much has been going on recently that I think we've become rather used to sudden surprises. Next! One less to worry about.
Got it. Understood. Inferno slash! Saurus, huh? These guys can be quite a handful. Yoy, this must be a potent opponent indeed to induce one such as Terry to quake. You're the only one quaking, tough guy. I eat chumps like this for breakfast. the whole package.